Hey guys, Zen up here, and today we are looking at a property that maybe possibly we might buy. This is courtesy of one of our subscribers, which we will see more from later, whether we buy this or not, because they're awesome. So, here is the house, uh, double wide manufactured home, uh, three bedrooms, uh, two bathrooms, it's about 15-ish years old. Um, it's got a well and a septic and electric comes from I think either that guy right there or one of the ones there in the back somewhere back there somewhere but there's the pump house there there's the wife and baby girl leaving uh, let's see so here is the driveway here we'll zoom out as far as we can for this whole thing and it goes along the road. Sheriff lives right over there. Well, deputy or someone. It goes all the way down to that truck down there. There's a road, I guess probably those uh, wooden poles there are the property lines. Right here. All the way down to the trees, back to those ones there. There in front of that car. Let's see one. Go all the way down that side of the road to. Sorry if you guys are getting some wind here, but that's what it's doing right now. Let's see here. Let's get a better shot. This is a fenced in pasture area, completely fenced. Okay, so let's see. It goes from here all the way down to that pole right there. Then it starts going across to, uh, let's see, that pole right there. And it comes all the way down and back to, well, I'll show you down there in a minute. This is about 2.1 acres, 2.2 acres, I think, something like that. So all of that, all back here, uh, that tree line there is the border. I think that's on the neighbor's property. It's got a nice deck. I mean, well, it needs to pretty much be redone, but it'll work for now. Here, is a spot where we can um, park the trailer and even have it hooked up to uh, the septic and the well and stuff. Right here is the septic. So going back here, uh, we follow the holes here to the fence. Let's see, so that last one there Okay, so from all the way down there, all the way to that last pole there, then straight across to, uh, let's see here, that piece of wood right there. And then all along the tree line all the way back. Here's the back of the trailer, or manufactured home. Uh, so, I think this leach field, septic, all that goes that way. So all of this here, we would do probably like chickens and whatnot, ducks, all in this whole area back here. Put baby girl's pool somewhere over here. And then all of that, the whole, the whole line bordering the property. We would do uh, trees and bushes and whatnot berries and whatever and then up here this would be grass area all of this up here would be just grass it's got sprinklers that every other one of them work well and the other ones need to be replaced but you know that's just what happens after 15 years or so uh, they're the only owners that have ever been here um, so they bought this new, put it on the property. Uh, 
let's see what else. Um. Hmm. Yeah, and then all of this here. Like I said, that's probably like a leach field back there. But look at, we have all this driveway slash parking area. All the way down to the driveway. Right here we could probably put, build a garage shop, something like that. Right next to the trailer. So 2.2 acres. Kind of thinking about it. All you know, we got to do is talk money. So that is the property that we are looking at today, and the one that we kind of really like, just because of all of the land that we can do stuff with, and really start doing the gardening that we want to do in the homestead that we want to do. Turn this all into green grassy areas where a lot of tents can go, trailers can go, we have all this parking spot, we can start having subscriber events, have you guys come out, visit, see the property, try things out, um, do classes and stuff on how to start uh, back eating gardens and whatnot. Let's see, I haven't really ever looked out here before. Drainage ditch. It's been pretty quiet out here too. We've got that mountain, well, mountain, We've got that hill right behind us there. A lot of nice houses. This house over here, it's like a four hundred and fifty thousand dollar house. It's like a huge garage and a house and a pool and. Is pretty way past my pay grade, but we can make this into that. So that's the one that we're looking at right now. Everything seems pretty flat. I mean, I can there's an opening back there in the fence in the gate back there somewhere, and I can probably just tear a couple of these parts of the fence out and just let chip trucks. All the tree services just pull in there and fill that whole thing a foot deep. That's probably that's probably an acre and a quarter, maybe an acre and a half. And they could just fill that a foot deep with wood chips. Let it sit for a year and then just go to town. See this whole borderline here? See? Tree, 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 all the way down this whole thing. In between the trees, we put all the different berry bushes and whatnot. And in between those, we put all of the um, vegetables along the whole border here. And we have, an, we have an entire garden we haven't even touched any of that. There's probably even enough room there to put a pond in. I don't know. We'll see. Well, that's all I have for this video. As always, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. Check us out on the website. And uh, we'll see you guys on the next one. Here's a little driving view of the property, the borders, the outside exterior. tree line back there. That's the entire property.